Yeah, don't move it, though. I always got to stop. Yeah, because you know, it's all talking. You just want to come up here and get a point at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's off stage. Yeah, I'm going to be in the middle. Yeah, I'm going to be in the middle. Yeah, I'm going to be in the middle. Yeah, like I said, you always see. That's why I keep showing you the videos. Every time they target me heavily to this point, they always got to start some shit on the bus. You know? And, uh... You know, they do it to show me that um, just how much division they can cause amongst black people. So this woman gets on the bus, she's about to go into her seat. And this gentleman, older gentleman, okay, uh, jumped into the seat before she can get to the seat. So she was there cursing him out. She was like, listen, I was going to sit there, you sit there. So he's arguing and stuff like that. She's arguing back and forth with him. Then another dude gets up. Uh, older guy too talks about uh, I'm like I don't get up to give my seat to no woman unless she's a very old woman and such and such you know that is the uh, the mindset of which particularly black people have men and women okay because like I said I've seen it many times but they're showing me how the uh, white people will get on the bus and you know Particularly, all the black women would get up and give them uh, a seat, right? Or if a white woman with a stroller, they get up quick, fast, and give them the seat. But if a black woman gets on the bus, she has a child in her hand, you know, a young baby or, or uh, a stroller, they will sit there and not get up at all. And I'm usually the one that's getting up to give that uh, woman, that black woman with a child, a seat or any black woman for a matter of fact whether they're young or what have you unless they're like teenagers then you know <laughs> unless they're like very very young um you know because i again i walk with a cane you know there's very few times where black people will get up and give me a seat okay and i always thank those that do because you know this is this is how we treat each other you know, this is how we treat each other and they know it they know exactly how they condition us how they can turn us against each other how they can manipulate us okay how they can abuse us how they can get us to abuse each other you know particularly with religion and you would think that black people being the most religious people in america christians here got the the deportation team is come walking over here with the Grenadian flag yeah you're gonna wear black with them yeah you're gonna wear black with them <laughs> you see that you hear that you guys know all right so anyway um this is what they're doing right this is this is this is what they're doing look 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 it comes over here yeah i'm gonna record it i'm gonna post it you know do whatever you want to do but i'm exposed what y'all doing so again like i said this is it's, it's more than just me okay this is about the future generations who will be targeted in this manner particularly by religious groups who is in league with white supremacy and white supremacists i have no problem forcing it i have no problem with the consequences whatever they want to do i have no problem with that but i would not stand silent and be and have you know, after being manipulated being drugged being brainwashed and thinking that they can get away with it because there is no evidence of what i'm saying i'm showing you the evidence that yeah, these things don't exist and these parts are fully active and how they can villainize and manipulate people here to rest really turn the room. Oh, I'm coming back this way. Don't worry, I'm coming back this way. So this is what they're doing, okay? And why? During the process of them brainwashing you and manipulating you, they'll use it to try to bring you to Christ, okay? Because he understand how black people are conditioned with religion, particularly Christianity, and it makes them passive, passive and docile to the ill treatment, to the abuse of this white supremacist system. Okay, because their belief is that they're going to they're going to pray to God and this and this and all this stuff. But you know, no matter how much they pray, the same should keep happening. But they wouldn't learn. They, they don't understand because again, that's part of their mental condition and religion. Okay, so if they don't get angry enough the way they're going to do something to where you know other groups of people will think twice before doing that to black people again you know i'm saying so you know that i understand that and i i, I basically I, I thoroughly understand what's going on particularly us here within the black community okay
okay? It's the Archimedes and Reflect people there. We are conditioned uh, 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 to the eye. We drop his wallet purposely. We drop his wallet on the floor. Right? <laughs> it's showing the ID. <laughs> like, who gives a shit, brother? Uh, fuck out of here, bring it myself. So, anyway, like I said, they, they do it from time to time to show me exactly how much control they have for black people. But of course, you know, they don't want to listen to me because I'm crazy. <laughs> right? I'm crazy, right? But they're the ones that's crazy. They see the truth, they hear the truth, but they don't believe in the truth. They rather keep continue to believe in the lies because it makes them feel good. You know, it makes them it makes them feel good, right? They say the brain is a, is 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 a amazing thing in which it can be programmed, and they don't even want to believe that their brain can be programmed. Why? Because they don't understand science, they lack the knowledge, science and technology. They want nothing to do with it except to use it, but they don't want to understand it. You know? This is again. This is what they're doing. Okay. So yeah. So look at the palm fixation drill. And it's behind the back. We just open up his hand wide so I can see it. So yeah. It is what it is, man. That's why I continue to do what I do. It's important. This is important work that I, I have to do. Okay. Very very important work that I have to do. So I'm gonna continue to do it no matter what.